according to the needs of military forces of the Republic of Belarus, for engaging targets within a 300-kilometer range, Belarusian enterprises have developed a unique missile complex, Polonaise, which have successfully passed military inspection and government tests. Advanced Belarusian and foreign technology used in the complex allowed to create a mobile and high-precision device for fire destruction, allowing to provide all firing solutions in all types of military actions any time of the year, 24-7. Significant firing and maneuver possibility of the complex allowed to view it as a great deterrence factor, which can influence military and political decisions. The complex has been admitted into the army of the Republic of Belarus. Polonaise is intended for the engagement of critical targets within a selected kill zone in the course of deep strikes at a range of 50 to 300 kilometers. This system is equipped with guided missiles located in eight launch pods. The diameter of the guided missiles is 301 millimeters. The length is a maximum of 7.49 meters and the maximum weight of the warhead is 140 kilograms. Depending on the range to the target to be engaged, this system can use missiles with a 50 to 200 kilometer range and missiles with a 120 to 300 kilometer range with different types of warheads, HE, HE frag, and HE Aspers frag warheads intended to engage all the corresponding types of targets. Polonaise has been developed on the basis of 8x8 and 6x6 AWD serial chassis that are produced in Belarus and have proven their quality worldwide in the course of operations. High reliability and repair capability, long TBF, contribute to the sustainable technical readiness of the vehicles. The combat vehicle transforms into the firing position automatically and its launcher is guided automatically as well. The combat vehicle of the Polonaise missile system is deployed within a maximum of two minutes. The missiles are prepared for launch within a maximum of eight minutes. Before launch, when the missile is located in the launching pod, it receives and accepts data via satellite signals on the current coordinates that are used to control the missile along its entire trajectory. After firing, the spent solid propellant rocket engine detaches and only the warhead remains in motion, leaving only a small reflective surface. The flight speed at the end of the active flight trajectory is a maximum of 1600 meters per second. The ceiling of the missile's flight trajectory is a maximum of 50 kilometers. All these features make the missile a barely visible target. The missile is controlled by means of the combined inertial satellite control system that minimizes missile deflection from the estimated trajectory during the entire flight. The missile approaches its target at a maximum 80 degree angle. The approach speed is a minimum of 700 meters per second. There is only a very slight possibility that air defense weapons will be able to intercept the missile. Precision of target engagement, CEP, circular error probable, is equal to just 30 to 45 meters, depending on the type of rocket. A strike can be performed by means of one missile towards a singular target or several missiles towards multiple targets at the same time. The missiles are guided to the center of the assigned kill zone. Flight missions for each of the missiles are computed and entered in automatic mode. One combat vehicle engages a maximum eight targets in one salvo. The combat vehicle can engage targets within a 400 square kilometer area without changing elevation and azimuth guidance angles of the combat vehicle launcher. All this makes the strike completely unexpected, leaving the enemy with no time and possibilities for maneuvering. This system consists of the combat control vehicle, combat vehicle and transloader. This system may also include UAVs, technical maintenance vehicles, C2 vehicles, etc. The combat control vehicle is intended to control the system during missile preparation and strikes. The vehicle has four workstations, one of which is remote. 
All of them are equipped with protected means of communication, automation and data transmission via a unified interface developed and produced in Belarus. Means of life support enable the combat crew to fulfill their duties to the full extent under any climatic conditions. The combat vehicle has a total of eight guided missiles in launching pods. The launcher of the combat vehicle makes it possible to guide the launching pods within plus or minus 30 degrees about azimuth and within 20 to 58 degrees about elevation in reference to the vehicle axis. It can receive the order for missile launch from the combat control vehicle either in the automatic mode via automation and data transmission means or in the form of voice messages via communication means. The combat vehicle is independent and can be used both as a part of a missile unit and on its own at separate attack axis. It is possible to enter target coordinates manually into the computer of the combat vehicle. The transloader is intended to transport eight missiles in launching pods and load them to the combat vehicle. For this purpose, the transloader is equipped with a loading crane that enables simultaneous loading of four missiles into the launching pods. The full cycle of combat vehicle loading does not exceed 20 minutes. Any missile unit of any composition and structure can adopt the Polonaise system. At the same time, a battery may operate two to eight combat vehicles that can be deployed within a 400 square kilometer area. The means of communication, automation and data transmission enable the data exchange as follows. In a VHF-UHF band, when stationary, at a maximum of 30 kilometers, on the move, at a maximum of 10 kilometers. In an SW band, when stationary, at a maximum of 300 kilometers, on the move, at a maximum of 50 kilometers. When a battery uses eight combat vehicles, it can engage a maximum of 64 separate targets in one salvo or execute several massive missile strikes, having the possibility to change the starting position or reload in a prompt manner. So far, the Polonaise missile system is one of the best in its class. Its design successfully combines the best features of multiple launch rocket systems and tactical missile systems. The Polonaise missile system essentially improves firing and combat capabilities of the armed forces of any state. <laughs>